Hi Leo, thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel. Welcome back to Yansa's Universe, it's me Yansa, and welcome to all my new viewers and subscribers. So my birthday was on the 8th, August 8th, so the Lion's Gate was at its peak on my birthday and the new moon was on my birthday. <sighs> Leos, oh y'all know I love y'all. Um, This is your general reading that will include 18 plus love messages at the end. Um, Leo, I see that there's someone, there's someone who wants to talk to you. I feel like it's someone who's been in and out of your life. They really want to talk to you, but I don't know if they're afraid or I don't know if you're completely done, but this person would rather just walk away. I feel like this person would rather walk away or this person would rather not say anything at all than just talk to you, even though they really want to talk to you. So I feel like eventually sooner Sooner rather than later, hopefully they do come talk to you. But maybe some of you don't care. So, shit, hopefully not. Who knows? I just know there's someone who really wants to talk to you. But this person would rather just stay silent. I don't know why. You know? Maybe this person has no right to talk to you. The audacity of this person. How dare you be in and out of my life? And then have the nerve to contemplate saying something. But you know what? It really depends on if the person is really truly sorry or not. All right, that was just what I saw in your pre-shuffle. Remember my loves, this is general. If the reading doesn't resonate, it's not for you. If the reading doesn't resonate now, it could resonate later, okay? This is for August 9th through the 14th for this week, okay? Um, 9th through the 14th, 2021. August 9th through the 14th, 2021, okay? And so because these messages are general, if it doesn't resonate with you, Leo, it could resonate with your cross washer. That's why we say flip the rose, okay? Just because I say Leo doesn't mean I'm I it's not the cross washer situation. Just because I say cross washer doesn't mean it's not Leo situation. And it can be so general that it could resonate in your family life, career, finances, anything. So let's start with the general portion first. Thank you, ancestors and guides, for giving me a message for Leo. Leo, someone rising in Venus and or any cross watcher or anyone with Leo in their chart. I'm going to pull three cards. One for you, one for your person and or situation and the advice slash outcome. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I've been sick, you guys, so I'm sorry. Eight of Wands. Yeah, this came out of your pre-shuffle. So communication, travel, okay? For me, this person and or situation. Two cards. Three cards. Death, Seven of Wands, Page of Wands. A lot of fire energy. Even the Scorpio card has fire on it, okay? So you have the Eight of Wands. A lot of communication and travel, Okay. So your person or situation, there was an ending, but there's a rebirth. But there is, you are on the defense. Your person is on the defense. Your person could be on, see, look, exactly. Look, this is exactly what I just said in the pre-shuffle. Okay, look. Your person is on the defense, seven of wands. Defense. On whether they should just end this. Or start it up again. Rebirth. Whether they should just end this or start it up again. Page of Wands. They want to talk. They want to communicate with you. In a sense. So I'm seeing um, some of you could possibly want to get pregnant and or are trying to have a child. Your person could have proposed having a child. Give me one last card for the outcome and the right advice. Four of Cups. Awareness. So, being aware that there is a decision to make. Being aware that there is a choice. Being aware of the situation. Being aware of your emotions. What's going on? How do I feel? What's going on? How do they feel? Okay? Ace of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Okay emotions so eight of wands you're you're ready to move forward you're ready for communication whether this person comes forward to talk to you or not you're not stopping you're not waiting if they want to come talk they better come talk now no hard feelings eight of wands ain't no hard feelings we go we communicating it's okay we're having a conversation if not i'm still on a roll i'm still moving right 
your person on the defense should i probably feeling very defensive leo you know how y'all get in y'all season fuck it it's my birthday man it's my birthday i don't have time to be sitting waiting around for a motherfucker on my birthday hey, you're tripping i went to vegas for my birthday okay all right all right <laughs> but i'm just saying this person is on the defense like why are they gonna come with all this bullshit on your birthday make up your fucking mind motherfucker you what the fuck we going what we doing four cups what are we doing awareness we need to be aware of what we're doing what the fuck we doing all right i'm good with or without you don't come to me with all no confusion and bullshit they want to talk is they gonna talk or not I don't think you care either way. Clarify the Eight of Wands for Leo. Three of Cups. Leo don't care either way. We happy regardless. You coming forward or not? Because I'm drinking, ha having fun, celebrating. I got a flight to catch for my birthday. Okay? Leo's getting everything they want. Five of Swords. I'm getting what I want. I don't give a... Why are you going to come to me with that bullshit? I'm ready for it. <laughs> I'm ready. Look, Queen of Cups, got all the love you need. Seven of Swords. I feel like you dodging this. If this person don't, if this person does not come to you correct, you are dodging this. But this could be Leo, Crosswatcher, indecisive as fuck on what they gonna do. Tiptoeing around the situation, halfway in, halfway out. One minute, want to rest and take a break. Next minute, I want to come forward. Next minute, they don't know what the fuck they want to do. Man, get out of here with all that shit. Clarify seven of wands. Five of wands. The fuck? The fence and... Look, this person... I feel like this person is dramatic. I don't feel like it's as deep as it is. And if it was as deep as what it is, then shit. I feel like they're trying to build up their courage and their defenses just in case you do attack, Leo. Just in case you do. Because this person already feels like there's going to be an argument. the fuck you coming to me with all this drama for on my birthday five of wands drama the fuck clarified the death card three of wands so this person still don't know what to do whether they gonna come forward or walk away this is an indecisive ass person clarify the page of wands five of cups the devil so this person is still lusting after you Wants to talk to you hot in the pants, but this person is sad as fuck. Have you ever met a sad as fuck, a sad, horny person? Sad as fuck, horny as, horny as fuck. I can't even say horny. I don't even talk like that. So this person is sad, yet still got a hard dick. This person is sad as fuck, but still got a wet pussy. What is this? Does, does it make sense to you? Help it make sense to me, please. The devil card. Sad as fuck, but horny as fuck. That's a toxic combination. You don't want no sad, horny dick. I promise you don't. Clarify the four of cups. Strength. <laughs> Awareness. Okay, you gotta be aware on what it is that you that you are holding back from aware of what it is that you are giving to because the strength card is like okay i'm giving okay i'll give to the situation or i'll hold back from the situation you got to be aware of what you're giving to and what you're holding back from okay this person wants you but this person don't know whether they want to give or hold back the fuck do they want clarify the five of cups Page of Swords. All they know how to do is stalk you and be immature with communication? This what we own? Clip out the Five of Wands. Ten of Cups? But you make them happy? But they don't like the fact that you make them happy? The fuck? This person is so confused and conflicted. I don't want Leo, but Leo's the one that made me happy. I would be happy with anyone else if it wasn't Leo. Oh my gosh, how could I have failed for Leo? I could have failed for anyone else but Leo. What you mean I'm not good enough? What you mean? To the cups, bitch. To the cups, yes. Yes, I make you happy. Yes. 
the fuck? It's the real deal, Holyfield. I just feel like like the audacity of this person. They can't make up their mind. They're so in love with you that it makes them sick. Like, this person is obsessed as fuck, but they're angry and sad. Like, I feel like this you made this... Not you, and I'm not blaming you, Leo. But you know how you can be so nice to a person who's going through shit and they resent you for it? You can be so nice to a person and show them nothing but love and kindness and... You make that person bitter. It's happened to me many a times. That's why I be trying not to be nice to people at all. I be trying not to be nice. It just like, oh my fucking. But it's so weird because not being nice just doesn't, it doesn't come out right for me. Like, it, I still end up being nice anyway. Side story. So on my trip to Vegas, I went to Vegas on my birthday. Tell me why this lady, this motherfucking lady, Gets on the plane with two kids, a six-year-old and a ten-year-old. Why do this bitch sit all the way in the front and her kids sit all the way in the back? Just so happen to sit with me. Why the fuck ain't you sit with your damn kids? And I'm looking around like, whose kids are these? And she's like, oh, um, oh, I can sit with them. And I'm just like, you know what? Because I don't want the kid, because they're white kids. I don't want, you know... I don't, I don't want white kids to, you know, angry late black lady. I wasn't angry, but I'm just like, I don't want to sit with your damn kids. It don't matter if they was black kids. It don't, it, don't, it don't matter what type of kids it was. But I'm just like, it's cool. It's cool. I'm going to sit with your kids. The kids turned out to be cool as fuck. They invited me to their house to go swimming and shit. You know how white kids are. Nothing wrong with white kids. Love them kids. If I ever see them kids again, you know, they're my kids. But... I'm oh I'm over here like whose kids are these? I'm gonna be mean. I'm gonna say no, right? And end up I fuck with these kids. I fuck with them. These are my kids now. Like <laughs> it just don't come out right. It just <laughs> it just I tried to be mean. I really did. But Spirit said, you know what? Talk to them kids. Because, you know, you never know. You never know. And the lady ended up telling me, thank you so much. I just needed a break. I'm about to have a meltdown. We're going to go see their grandparents. I just need a break. And I'm just like, all right. Spirit told me to be calm. But, shit, if that was anything else, I would have said no. <laughs> all right. That was just a side story, y'all. I'm sorry. I, I'm over here talking about myself. I'm going to pull a couple more messages because some of y'all might not be in a relationship. Some of y'all might be single. So, I done took up all y'all damn reading. Eight of Swords, Ace of Swords, The Hangman. So, this is a singles reading in the tower at the bottom. So, singles. Clarify the Eight of Swords. The Hermit. So, for some reason, singles, you're depressed. Or some reason, singles, you, like, I'm single. And this is, like, I I prayed to God. And I was like, you know what, God? Fuck, fuck men. I'm not talking to men. I'm going to take a whole year off to focus on myself. Took off all my dating websites. This could be what you guys are doing. Leo, you're putting yourself on lockdown mode to really focus on yourself. Focus on your healing. Focus on your weight. Focus on your body. You know, Eight of Swords. A lot of meditation. A lot of self-work. Self-love. Ace of Swords. You need more clarity. Eight. The hangman. This is something you decided to do. Clarify the tower, though. Something is coming. Or something is going to be realized. The fool... Nine of Wands, Empress, Three of Pentacles. So, out of nowhere, like, I know you're taking this long break off to seek clarity and look at things from a different situation. And because of this, out of nowhere, like, you're going to see your progress out of nowhere. Like, you're going to see the shift is going to happen like that. And I'm not saying it's going to happen the same day. I'm just saying after this long period of focusing on yourself and self-love, you're just going to wake up one day and you're going to be the empress. 
You're going to wake up one day with the full card, new beginning. Like, it's just going to happen. And you won't even notice it until it happens. So, it doesn't matter how long it takes. It could be eight weeks for you. Eight months for you. Because I see the eight of swords with the hermit. So, eight weeks, eight months, however, however long. Right? And then we got the nine of wands. You're protecting yourself. Three of pentacles. People are, you, you're going to have a lot more help, a lot more stability. Right? A lot more clarity, a lot more peace. And it's just going to happen out of the blue for you, singles. You, you're the new you. It's going to happen out of nowhere after this time that you spend with source, this time you spend with spirit, this time you spend doing self-love. I see a lot of money as well. Okay, we're moving into the 18 plus love portion. So let's jump into it for Leo. We have hotel sex so y'all could be having sex this week well get enough for me uh <laughs> I'm just celibate okay hotel sex it says i want to put my tongue in it you could be dealing with a sagittarius i want to put my tongue in it <sighs> Threesome. Ooh. Stomach kisses. <laughs> okay. And then we have massage. Massages and back rubs. So you guys could be having hotel sex this week. Okay. Somebody wants to put their tongue in it. You could be having a threesome or somebody could be talking to you about a threesome. Somebody's giving you stomach kisses and a back rub or you're giving someone a massage you're getting a massage okay anything else for leo i'm toxic we we already figured that out with the double card coming out for your crazy ass person i'm sorry i forgot to mention the signs you could be dealing with anybody i'm sorry i saw capricorn who the fuck else did i see capricorn Anybody, y'all. I'm sorry. I forgot the signs. I'm sorry. Damn, I'm sorry. Squirt. Can I make you squirt? So you can be dealing with a Capricorn, a Virgo, any earth sign, any air sign. I saw everybody I saw everybody except fire. Okay. Squirt. Can I make you squirt? So y'all are squirting this weekend. Somebody wants to make you squirt. This toxic person wants to make you squirt. These are the same. You see the same card, same color. Sorry for the noise. I still want you. I'm still in love with you. I'm still in love with you, boy. <laughs> I'm still in love. <laughs> this person, you know this person crazy as fuck. They coming to you telling you they toxic. That's why they can't make up their mind. They know they toxic as fuck. They know it. But this person is still in love with you. They still want you. And they want to know, can they make you squirt? They want to have some hotel sex. Maybe this is you, Leo. Leo toxic than a bitch. Okay? Leo said, I'm finna pick you up. We going to the hotel. Leo said, meet me at the motherfucking hotel. I'm not playing these games with you, Crouch Watcher. Put on that shit I like. It's just something about our makeup sex. I told you. Y'all having makeup sex in the hotel. I'll go as long as it's food. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. It's just something about our makeup sex. This person is toxic than a bitch and they're crazy. I wouldn't be surprised if crazy or obsessed came out. They crazy. Okay? I don't need a card to tell me. They crazy. Call me daddy or call me mama. Okay? So somebody want to put their tongue in it while they're giving you... Okay, somebody's going to put their tongue in it, and then afterwards, somebody's getting stomach kisses. Okay, while y'all in the hotel, somebody going to do something that you, you know this person toxic to the bitch. You know it. All right? But it's just something about y'all makeup sex. Y'all going to be squirting. They're going to tell you that they still in love with you and that they still love you, and you're going to be like, fuck this motherfucker crazy. Okay? And then something about a threesome now. Y'all could be into that. Y'all could be into that. 
I try not to moan because I'm a man. You got that good ass pussy, bitch, and you over here making me have a. I'm a man, I can't moan like that. <laughs> I'm a man, I can't moan like that. Bitch, why your shit so good? I didn't mean for it to go this far. So somebody, somebody done took it too motherfucking far. You took it too far, you toxic ass bitch. <laughs> you took it too far. Motherfucker. Reverse cowgirl. Okay. They like that. I'm pussy whipped. Do I need to go on? This motherfucker is pussy whipped. Could be dealing with the Taurus. Aquarius. Oh Lord. Could be dealing with an Aquarius. Y'all know the Aquarius crazy. Y'all know. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius, Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Libra. Any fucking body. It could be anybody. Look. Y'all having a quickie in this hotel. I don't want to be loved. I don't want to be loved. I just want a quickie. No bite marks, no scratches, and no hickeys. Okay? They possessed as fuck. And this person masturbates to your photos. Golly. Oh, this person crazy as fuck. So if you if you ever get a random thought about this person, they're masturbating to your photos. Ain't even been thinking about that motherfucker. And then all of a sudden, somebody crossed your mind. Where the fuck they come from? They got your photos. Baby, come back. You can blame it all on me. <laughs> <laughs> what's this person hiding from leo or what do they want to say to leo what's the hidden truth remember cross watcher it could be flipped so it could be what leo is hiding what they want to say okay or what's the hidden truth show me what's going on for leo please one more thank you you and i were too young Mm. Can y'all see that? You and I were too young. So many things remind me of you. <laughs> so many things remind me of you. I feel you even though we are apart. So, for those of y'all, and I'm not trying to gas y'all up. I'm not trying to gas y'all up. Sometimes people, I'm so attracted to you. Yeah. Just more confirmation. I'm so attracted to you. Yeah. So, I wonder if you're happy without me. Yeah, this motherfucker is crazy than a bitch. This motherfucker is crazy. Um, if you think this person is not thinking about you, please. So many things remind you of this. Remind this person of you. So many things. And then, if you think this person is not thinking about you, or, you know, sometimes... She can be more real for one person than the other. And that's okay. Fuck it. They should have been honest and truthful in, in the beginning. But you found out what it was. And you governed yourself accordingly. And deaded the situation. Right? But it says I feel you even though we are apart. So you still have some effect on this person. Um, people be acting. People be acting. Motherfuckers should win an award. A Grammy for acting. Okay? Motherfuckers be acting. So. So many things remind this person of you. This person feels you even though y'all are apart. They feel like y'all were too young. So maybe a lot of shit happened. You know, they didn't mean for it to go this far. But this person is attracted to you. So if this person knocked your self-esteem and made you feel ugly and treated you like an option. Because I'm just getting a lot of feelings from this card. I'm so attracted to you. It was never you. Ever. It was never you. This person thought that you were the most sexiest person in the world. But they don't know how to love you right. They don't know how to talk to you right. They don't know how to treat you. And they not your self-esteem. I don't understand how people can do that, but it happened. So, fuck them. Let's get some advice. It happened. So, okay, while I'm shuffling. So, it says I'm so attracted to you. Remember in the first reading, 
that I did and the devil card came out with the page of wands, seven of wands, death card about how this person really liked you and they were attracted to you, but they were sad, but they were, could still get hard and shit like that. Y'all have to rewind it to the beginning. That's what's going on. All right, moving forward. Give me some advice for Leo and or cross watcher. Prosperity lies ahead, no moon in Taurus. So like I said, Leo's moving forward with or without this person. Prosperity lies ahead. So move forward because shit, go towards your prosperity. Oh shit. Sorry, y'all, I got my waist trainer on. It's killing me. Meditate and contemplate. New moon in Pisces. So as you meditate and contemplate, this could be for the singles because remember, we got the eight of swords and the hermit for you singles. You're meditating. And Pisces is the opposite of Virgo. So you can be dealing with anybody, like I said. Um, meditate and contemplate. Here's some advice for you. Meditate. Right? Prosperity lies ahead. Move forward. So you got new moon in Taurus, new moon in Pisces. So you have two new moons. The new moon just came August 8th. So you you got to change. You you got to you can't you can't stay the same. It's a new moon. Right? Balance spirituality and practicality. Pisces could be very important. That's the advice that I have for you. I'm going to pull a romance angel and end this reading. We've been here too fucking long. Been so long. He's been on. Give me a message for Leo, please. I get so wrapped up in y'all. Y'all know I'm a Leo. My birthday was on the 8th. <sighs> I just fucking love y'all. Trust. Watch the Sagittarius. Was that Sagittarius? Watch the Sagittarius reading. Trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. So have faith, Leo. Have faith that everything's going to work out. Don't hold on to how you think it should work out. Just have faith that divine is going to make it work out for your best good. Regardless of who's in your life, who leaves your life, who enters your life. Trust and have faith. So, I love you, Leo. Have more faith. I need to close my fucking window. I love you, Leo. Have more faith. <laughs> Stay tuned to your next reading. Bye.